creation of the Petawawa Sports Hall of Fame was officially kicked off at a small press conference at the Civic Center, releasing the names of the first six inductees. This event is a setup for the official induction ceremony to be held on Friday, June 15th, to be emceed by none other than former MP Hector Cloutier. And I have to say, it's, uh, people are going to find that it's, it's an extraordinary class of six individuals. Uh, people around here may be shocked to learn who has lived and come from this town and gone on to do great things. Entering into the entertainment class, Joshua Hopkins. He was raised in Petawawa and a graduate from the former General Panay High School. He is now an accomplished opera singer, performing most recently as Harry Bailey in the Houston Grand Opera's world premiere of It's a Wonderful Life. Also in the entertainment category, Jason Blaine. He spent the first six years of his life in Petawawa and has never forgotten his roots. Following that up in the athletes category is Ray Shepard. Ray uh, Shepard was raised in a military family, attending several base Petawawa schools, including Pinecrest. As a youth, he played seven years with the Petawawa Patriots minor hockey. In 1984, he was selected 60th, 60th overall by the B Buffalo Sabres in the NHL entry draft. Next in the athlete category, hailing from one of Petawawa's founding families, Roy Giesebrecht. He played his junior hockey career with the Pembroke Lumber Kings and played over 130 NHL games, becoming a local hockey icon. And now on to the builders class, Fred Molson. Fred envisioned uh, a place where folks young and old could enjoy downhill skiing. Uh, to that end, he opened up the Petawawa Ski Hill on Laurentian Drive, uh, which became affectionately known as Mount Molson and still is today. Rounding out the inductions is Willard Moans, known for some key recreational facilities in the town of Petawawa, including the Petawawa Civic Center. For the complete press conference, head on over to our website. Reporting for Coach Co News, I'm Trevor Riley.